At the Info Ag Conference, I am visiting with uh, Matt, and uh, Matt works for GeoVantage. Uh, Matt, first of all, I want you to tell me a little bit about uh, GeoVantage, because I'm not even uh, real familiar with, with the company. You bet. Well, here at GeoVantage, we provide high resolution uh, aerial imagery using manned aircraft. Uh, we offer three products, uh, one meter, a half meter, and a quarter meter resolution. Um, we have direct customers and also um, API connections with other uh, main software providers in the business today. Here at the conference, which is another record-breaking one for InfoAg, I'm sure you've had some interaction with our attendees. What is it that you want them to know when they uh, come and visit GeoVantage? Uh, basically, we, we walk them through the process of, of ordering imagery, um, let them know who our, our partners are in this business. Um, you know, also a big, a, big, um, a big part of the discussion is letting them know the geography that we cover. Uh, we cover uh, uh, basically the, the lower 48 with Canada, um, able to provide services with sensors, you know, basically anywhere that any agricultural needs may arise. I understand that another of the exhibitors here, which is MapShots, and you have a, a collaboration. Can you describe how you guys are working together? Well, we've both uh, been able to um, take advantage of API connections and, um, you know, essentially MapShots customers can place an order right through their, their studio, studio platform, which essentially comes to me directly at GeoVantage. Um, from there, our, our operations team takes over, um, flies the imagery um, using our own integrated mission plans, processes the imagery, and, and ultimately we deliver it right back through that connection. Uh, so the customer doesn't really even know, other than from a billing standpoint, that they're, they're interacting with anybody else. Um, from a data privacy standpoint, all of our, all the information comes to us as alphanumeric code. So um, there's really no data privacy issues on our behalf. We keep everything uh, confidential. And um, you know, if there, there's any question or any concern, those go directly back to the, the person that orders the, the imagery directly. So do you have a pilot's license and get to go out there and do any flying? I do not. Uh, we own five aircraft ourselves and, and we contract pilots to, to fill those needs in those five planes. Um, other than that, we, we contract with, with guys all around the, the United States. Um, you know, agriculture is 50% of our business. The other 50% is, is forestry, oil and gas. So we've got an extensive network, uh, anywhere from 75 to 100 pilots on any given year that we work with on a regular basis. Fantastic. So, um, what else it, that we might not have touched on here? Is there anything else you'd like us to know? We, we've been hearing a lot of talk about what the future is going to look like in this precision area. But you how bet. about from your standpoint, anything you see, uh, especially as it relates to GeoVantage? Well, right now with GeoVantage, um, we offer our services in a, in a seven-day flight window. Um, we, let the, we let the user determine the, the, the target date. We choose three days before and three days after that target date. Um, once that image is flown, it only takes us 24 to 48 hours to put that image back in the user's hands. Um, and that's, that's pretty, pretty amazing for the industry that we're in right now. Um, high turnaround times are, are definitely in demand. Um, the future of GeoVantage, uh, we're, we're definitely looking at some, some newer, uh, newer bands, some newer technologies. Uh, there's, there's a high level of interest in, in the red edge. Um, and also in the thermal area as well. So those are two of the things that we're looking at bringing forth in, in 2016 and beyond. Fantastic. Well, thank you so much, Matt Sweeney with uh, GeoVantage. We've, vis we've been visiting here at the uh, InfoAg Conference 2015. I'm Chuck Zimmerman reporting.